Hi guys, so <coughs> it's Rose and I got this table and so I'm trying to put it up. It's a little corner table so that I can put my incense and stuff on. It's like that when it's up. It's got a place down here. It's got the table on the top, little table and a place to put my incense and bits and pieces. Um, so now is the process of sticking, putting it all together. Um, and believe me, I am so dumb at things like this. But I'm going to have a go. And you're going to watch me <laughs> as I do. This is going to be a laugh. Okay. So, I guess and that is the bottom. Okay, hang on a minute. Okay, guys, so this is a finished look. So I keep all my incense and my candles there. Put my incense on there. I'm going to get a mirror for here, a nice mirror. So, and then here is my balloon, my witchy board. Then I'm going to decorate with lots of necklaces and all sorts. So, yeah, hope you like it. Hi guys, so today we got a little craft uh, to do and, oh, sorry my toes sticking out the bottom, um, and it's a gem to hang in the window, it's like a, a, it's like a um, sun catcher, so what you're going to need is a bag of gems, any colour, I think mine are light green and orange. So yeah, I've got those. And then you're going to need clear gel or glue, clear glue, sorry. Um, and this is optional, but I'm going to put some of this in, uh, just a bit of glitter, only a small amount. So when it's in the sun, it will shine. It will shine it anyway. And something round that you can put the gems and the glue. So let's get started. Hi everyone, um, so I'm up here and so we're going to do this little, um, little catcher thing that you can put in your window, a uh, sun catcher and they're gorgeous. I've got some more that I'm going to do but I'm going to show this one first. Excuse me about my finger, I broke it off last night. So what you're going to do is if you can find plastic lids that would be ideal too but this is the only thing i can find at the moment um so i'm using a like a plastic sort of plate okay so what you're going to do is you're going to get your clear glue okay and you're going to pour that all around you can do different patterns like i did a um and i gave it to my friend i did a uh pentagram in the shape of a pentagram it was gorgeous so yeah so you can do anything you do flower designs all sorts okay so once you've got your glue in there you're going to take your um your stone okay and you're going to place them wherever you want them okay so they'll be flat side down so just drop them in there they're going to sink a little bit, like those are the. But once you get other stones around, they won't. And try and keep them. Can you see this? Oh, hang on, let me just put you down a bit more. Hang on, sorry about that. Um, yeah. Yeah. Sorry. Oh, gosh, I'm ever so sorry. <laughs> This glimmer phone thing will not go down. There we go. So, just throw them in as you go. Make sure they're on the flat side. That one's just turned over because it just wants to be a pain. Okay, so, put them all in. And what you'll do is you'll go right the way around with that and... Um, I'll come back and show you because it's a little bit time. Cause... Hi, 
I, are you, yep. So, um, <coughs> let me just wipe this. So, once they're done, so you can see, I'm not going to move the plate, but once they're done like that, okay, you're going to add some more glue on the top, just to see them all in. I know there's a lot there, but... So I'm gonna pull them all the way around. And this has to sit for at least a day or two. So it's good if you're doing it and you want to sell them or put them on Etsy or whatever. Um, best thing for you to do is do a batch of them. So do a few of them. And then um, that way you're getting quite a few of them out there. Anyway, so that's going to be a bugger and don't want to open. So now here's the glitter. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take some out of my fingers and just lightly sprinkle it over the top. Okay, only a little bit. Just to give, when it dries, it will dry with all the glitter on the top. Okay, so, and then what you're gonna do is put a little bit more glue so it seals in the glitter. And these look gorgeous when they're done. Okay, so we're gonna wait for that to dry. And, or you're gonna need some either, I use fish and lime because it's, smaller and it's see-through and it looks better with when the dries are all raw tie and it look nice okay everyone so that's my little hang on let me see that's my little D, uh, diy for today and um i've got loads more to do um i've got an idea for your mason jars that can be turned they can be turned into um sun catchers or they can be used as lids for your herbs and they're to do with flowers and yeah that's my next video my next project so take care for now i hope you like this little video please thumbs this video up and comment and uh, subscribe if you're not already blessed be